Hi there everyone, my name is Henry Beshley and I'm here to talk to you about early season fertiliser for the initiation of spring growth on your greens. Now, spring growth is really important agronomically um, for a number of reasons. Uh, we might have significant early renovations to complete, we might have disease scarring or wear and tear to recover from, or we might simply be wanting to make a good early start for the main plane season. Whatever the reason, we usually need to try to pr provoke some early growth in March and April. Now at ICL we tend to recommend fertilizers containing sulfate of ammonia as their primary nitrogen source because it is readily available for uptake and utilization at lower growing temperatures. The three granular greens fertilizers that we recommend for this time are from the Green Master Pro Light range. We have the Invigorator 408 plus 4% iron, the Turf Tonic 800 plus 3FE and the cold star which is an 1155 plus 8% iron and so you can already see that we have different fertilizer analysis that would uh, generate potentially very different responses. So here we have some demonstration plots. I applied each of the fertilizers um, that I just mentioned at the very start of February, which was five days ago now, to show you some responses. Uh, the first one up is the Green Master Pro Light Invigorator 40A, applied at 25 grams per meter squared and 35 grams per meter squared. Uh, so, in terms of the level of nitrogen, the 4% N applied at 25 grams per meter squared would apply in the region of supply in the region of 10 kilograms of nitrogen over four to five weeks. So, maybe two kilograms grams of nitrogen per week so that would just keep the, the, the turf ticking over in growing conditions but when the invigorator is applied at the higher rate 35 grams per meter squared it will be supplying 14 kilograms of nitrogen over maybe a five to six week period and so maybe up to three kilograms of nitrogen per week so you would get a stronger response obviously um, but it still might not be at the level that you're needing agronomically okay so second one up is a turf tonic which is the 8 naught naught plus iron firstly applied at 25 grams per meter square to deliver uh, 20 kilograms of nitrogen over that six week period so maybe uh, three kilograms of nitrogen per week uh, applied at 35 grams per meter squared you're looking at 28 kilograms of nitrogen over six to eight weeks um, so maybe three and a half or even up to four kilograms of nitrogen per week during that time so certainly a more powerful response given the right conditions Okay, so lastly, there's the cold start, the 1155 plus 8% iron applied firstly at 25 grams per meter squared to supply 27 and a half kilograms of nitrogen over a six week period. So four kilograms of nitrogen per hectare per week on average. So potentially a substantial response there. And then we have the 35 grams per meter squared application rate. So with that, you're nearly up to 40 kilograms of nitrogen delivered over six to eight weeks so maybe five or even six kilograms of nitrogen per week on average and this would provide a, a very strong response and would only really be chosen to generate recovery through heavy and repeated top dressings and when conditions are, are suitable we don't often recommend that kind of application rate for this product to me it's in danger of becoming potentially wasteful or or unnecessary for greens at this time you know that's a lot of nitrogen taken out of your annual nitrogen budget okay so we've got three very different early spring fertilizers and potentially six different responses um, depending on their application rates and you know you're trying to choose the right product at the right rate to get the correct agronomic response so look let's come back in a few weeks time and see how we're getting on